a new way, a new way to lose weight. It's a gut makeover. It is out now, and it promises a healthier you in just four weeks. Smart. Yeah, it's an amazing plan. A lot of new science here. You know, your gut is not just your waistline. It turns out there's an entire world living inside your stomach. Trillions of bacteria that could weigh up to four pounds. And wow. some even say they affect how you look and feel. So this new plan focuses on getting your gut in tip-top shape. The Gut Makeover, an overhaul for your insides, designed to help your body's good bacteria thrive and send bad bacteria packing. So good gut health will make you feel and look better. Absolutely. Nutritionist Jeanette Hyde, author of The Gut Makeover, says the balance of bacteria in your gut can influence everything from your weight to acne to allergies. And getting that balance right can make you feel better than ever. Her plan? Bombard your body with nutrients for four weeks, a variety of fruits and vegetables, as she showed us at the Institute of Culinary Education in New York City. This plan is all about abundance not deprivation. Here's how it works. In the first two weeks, eliminate sugar, wheat, alcohol, caffeine, and dairy, and avoid antibiotics, while increasing your intake of what she calls gut-friendly foods dramatically. If you normally just eat five or six different fruit or vegetables, think right, get 10 this week. <laughs> well, I encourage you to get up to 30 if 30 you can. 30 different fruits and vegetables? I do. 28-year-old Emily Ritter decided to try a New Year's gut makeover. I was like, okay, I'm going to do it. This is the perfect chance to kind of reset. Now, months later, she's down eight pounds and feeling great. In the end, my body and my stomach felt so much better. Jeanette's other tips, eat lots of gut-friendly foods, including prebiotics like cold potatoes and bananas, and look for the best probiotic foods, not supplements. Live bacteria, that's good for you. Things like Rockford cheese, sauerkraut, and kefir, a fermented milk drink, kind of like yogurt. So we're feeding that bacteria because we want it to thrive. That's exactly what you gotta do. Right, so we want to help that good bacteria okay. thrive. Jeanette recommends seven cups of fruits That's and a vegetables lot. a day. It is a lot. This is what it looks like. Less fruit you'll notice than vegetables because mm -hmm. I could eat seven cups of pineapple. That is not the point. <laughs> okay. Okay. And if you're looking for a way to save money, she recommends frozen fruits and vegetables. They are frozen at the peak of freshness, a lot more affordable, same nutrients. And you don't miss out on any of the nutrients. You don't miss the, the nutrients. And this, you know, you can throw it in a smoothie. Right. It's really easy. So right. there is an easy, affordable way to do this and get your, get your gut in shape. Let's do that. Yeah, let's Summer's do it. Summer is coming. Summer is coming. Right. Thank you. <laughs>